Hello, this is Amber with Lives in Sync Tarot. This is your daily reading for September 14, 2017. Your cards for today, King of Swords, Nine of Swords is back again, and the Lover's card. And of course, the card that we'll flip over at the end of the reading for extra guidance. So this will affect today, but not only Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And with the Lover's card, Gemini. Gemini could definitely be affected here, okay? So, today you are full of truths, clear thinking. There may also be um, an air sign of, involved, which I named at the beginning of the reading. But this is about being clear, okay? Um, cutting through, finding the truth, okay? Um, be careful that you're not manipulating yourself. Okay, by thinking something is going to work when it's not. This is also a form of abuse, okay, um, towards yourself, okay. Also be worried, worrying about someone being manipulating towards you because they're saying or doing something that looks very good, okay. I feel as though you may really want something and feel like it's a dream come true, but you need to look at the truth of the situation, okay and not be abusive, quote unquote, to yourself, all right? The situation is the nine of swords. This is definitely about obsessing, worrying, okay? Wanting the past to come back in. And that's why I feel it's important for you to, to lean on the truth of the situation and be clear thinking because you really want this to come back around, okay? And it, it, it's time for it to end, especially with the nine. The nine is about endings, okay? Completion, okay? Um, being, being very, selfless okay because it's something that you really want but maybe it's not the best for you all right um, with the challenge being the lovers it's about choices choices about who you choose to love in your life choices about what is best for you okay major decisions major choices that will make a difference in your life there may be someone offering you love um, I'm going to say Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces, okay, because the Knight of Cups was at the bottom of the deck and I just happened to flip it over, to be honest, okay. This could be a person that you don't know what to do with. This could be a love offer that you don't know what to do with, okay. But you really want, you really want this situation, but something about it just doesn't feel right, okay. Your Oracle card is playfulness, and playfulness is about... Spirit is actually telling me to read the book, which oh, I think I have it down here. Bear with me. Let's see what the book says. I rarely pull it out, so I don't have it on hand. Okay. Playfulness. Fun and play is the angel's way. They guide you to add fun to your life and know that fun is not a necessity it's a luxury exactly so just because this person may make you happy just because uh they may entice that playful side of you that they may um, be offering you love that you feel is amazing or just needed in your life doesn't necessarily mean that um, this is what's best for you. Okay. It's about making a major decision. Um, but do have fun, but I'm, I'm getting the feeling like you don't need to take it so seriously. Like this is such a major decision in your life, but think clearly. It's like going into a relationship that is fun, that, that you can have a little bit of excitement in, but you don't want to marry this person because it'll be a disaster, that type of energy. Okay. So I'll see you tomorrow. I love you very much. <laughs> love and light.